Most men have realized that after being intimate with their partner the first round, it is always difficult for them to go the second round. Honestly, most times, most women actually look forward to the second round. Why is this even happening? Is this a thing? Yes, it is a thing. And it's happening because of a reason. So we're going to be talking about it in this video, how you can shorten your refractory face and as well, how you can go multiple round. That is what we'll be discussing in this video. Hi, if you're seeing my Face for the first time my name is blessing and on this channel i create content regarding your health most importantly my goal is to help you to understand intimate stuff so kindly subscribe so you don't miss out on any of my videos why is it that it is always difficult for you men to go for the second round why is this happening there is something called sexual cycle in this sexual cycle it has a lot of faces like the excitement phase plateau phase this sexual cycle is the refractory phase basically this refractory phase is when your ability your desire to have sexual intercourse ceases temporarily it is definitely going to come back but this will take time depending on a lot of factors this refractory phase can actually last for minutes it can last for hours and some people it can even last for days like i said there are some factors that influence how long this refractory phase is going to last the number one factor that can affect this refractory phase is age when you are the age of 40 you tend to experience decline in sex drive and as well testosterone level tends to drop at this age research has even shown that men who are of younger age they tend to get out of this refractory phase quickly as compared to older men younger men tend to come out within 30 minutes within one hour as compared to men in their 70s that this refractory phase can actually last for hours like 20 hours and even more than that so age is a huge factor which there is actually nothing we can do about it because definitely you age aging is inevitable it is something that is bound to happen secondly your health health is one of the factors that can affect how long your refractory phase will last yes especially if you have health conditions like hypertension like diabetes so if your health is not so great it will definitely affect your sexual health as well because as we all know that the heart is a very very important organ when it comes to your penis health it is responsible for pumping blood to other parts of the body including your penis in which you need rush of blood to your penis to have your erection so you see that it is very very essential for your heart to be functioning properly now another factor that can affect how long this refractory phase will last is stress stress affects our health generally and your penis health is not left out especially anxieties most men the main reason why they're having issues with their penis health is because of anxiety they are stressed about a lot of things about the size of their penis about how long it is if the lady is enjoying it or not a lot of things are making men to think to have this fear this worry in their mind oh is she enjoying it oh will she like it you don't need all these things because if you focus more on yourself or on whatever you're thinking in your head you're calculating and all of that it can even make the first round to be horrible it can even make whatever you're doing not to be nice so it is better you do it the way you can and enjoy yourself focus on you enjoying yourself rather than you worrying if your partner will enjoy it or not and even when you guys worry about the size the shape and all of that you will be surprised that all this your worries actually have no effect on women you'll be surprised that the length you think women are actually looking for that is not the length it is i'm going to you know make a video to talk about you know the size of the pennies and even the one women like i'm going to discuss based on research i'm going to discuss it in another video now if you would ask me why is there even a refractory phase the refractory phase it is there in your body because it is meant to be as you all know that when you're having intimate with your partner it is you men who do most of the job and because of that if your body is not telling you to rest you can just go on and on and on and that is why this refractory phase is there and as well after intercourse there are several hormones in your body that is being released like oxytocin like prolactin all these hormones affect your emotions so the question of the day how can you go multiple round how can you solve this problem how can you shorten your refractory period let's start with age 
like i said aging is inevitable it is something that is bound to happen so you continue to age and also your testosterone level will continue to drop but there are some things that you can do to help you better your game things like having regular exercise remember what i said that your heart is the most important organ when it comes to your penis health so it is good for you to have exercise because exercise is good for the art especially walking go for regular checkup yes it is highly important if you don't get checked you will not know what is going on within your body so it is better you get checked if you are young and you are experiencing long period of refractory phase maybe it's taking you days before you can have your erection back then you might be suffering from erectile dysfunction so you should get checked speak with your doctor and you know so you know whatever that is going on because as a young man you're not supposed to last for you know days before you get your erection back also you need to eat healthy it is important for you to because your health is important same as your penis health i have a video on this channel that talk about penis friendly foods foods that are good for your penis health i'm going to link it in the description box so you can watch it after watching this particular one according to a 2018 study that was published in the journal of education and health promotion the following that i'll be discussing has been advised the number one thing that this study advised is for you to manage your stress manage your anxiety stress and anxiety can prevent you from achieving your sexual goal reduce your alcohol intake yes reduce your alcohol intake surprisingly most men think that when they take alcohol it helps them to perform better hell no alcohol is not viagra alcohol is not anything that can help you to achieve your sexual goal so instead of taking alcohol why not take fruits like watermelon if you can't take it as a fruit why not blend it as a smoothie and drink it also smoking smoking is bad we all know that for your health generally it is bad same for your penis it is really really bad for you because smoking can affect your erection it can affect you in a lot of ways i have a video as well on things that can reduce the size of your penis i'm going to link it in the description box as well so you can watch it as well i listed a lot of things in those videos so kindly go there and watch it after this one Thirdly, you should manage your health. Yes, if you know that you're having health conditions like hypertension, like diabetes, please manage it well. Take your medications as prescribed. Don't go on days and be like, oh, today I'm okay, I don't want to take it. Please take it as prescribed. Engage in cardiovascular exercise, like walking, like jogging, and as well, know your limits. Mm know your limits if you're old it is expected for you to have this refractory phase to last for hours it is okay it is expected that is because you are old and aging is inevitable i've said it thousand times in this video you cannot stop aging you will continue to age so don't work yourself up because of that i hope you've learned something from this video today kindly share to other men so they can learn as well if you're a woman watching this video please share to your man so he can watch and learn as well and i will see you in my next video please don't forget to check the description box for the videos that i will recommend after this so you can watch them bye